what's up guys welcome back to my channel today's video i'm doing a review on the woman's dunk glow pink foam lx stay tuned to the end of the video where i try these on i'm just gonna show them what they look like on my feet and yeah i got this pair from sneakers these actually had dropped on april 6th i have been getting so many pink sneakers recently they had gave exclusive access to the wash pink ones so Look forward to that review when that comes into the mail. Let's get started on these. These are so freaking pretty. If you're a guy watching this, you got a girl, you gotta get her these. If you're a girl watching this, you gotta just, you gotta get them. Reading from the box, it says, Women's Nike Dunk Low LX Pink Foam Pure Platinum. And then I got a size six in women's, so that's a men's four and a half. Retail on these, I believe was 120. Um, that's a little, a little much, but they're more than just a regular dunk, so I've already tried them on and everything. I already had changed the laces on them, so they did come with a black and pink striped looking laces. Personally, I don't like those laces at all, so I had to immediately change them into these pink laces. This is what they look like. They have like that really nice pink. It's kind of like a Barbie pink in my opinion. The material on this is definitely like higher than a regular Panda Dunk Glow or anything like that, but it's not to the extreme of an SB level, but it's in between. I would say that's definitely obviously why they're a little bit more than a regular dunk would be. The material on this is like a rough suede, especially the toe box. You, can, you can't really tell on camera. It's a little rough. You can see like the hair is coming up on the toe box. So starting with the outsole, it's got that pink color. I'm gonna call it a Barbie pink because that's literally what it is. I have the white right here and then they go back with that nice Barbie pink and like that rough suede. Some of it's like smooth suede and then the toe box is rough suede. And then you have like this, I would say like it's an off whitish cream color. Then the swoosh is that white color. And then over here you again have that rough toe box and that color that's like an off-white cream. I'm not too sure what color this is. Again, you have the pink laces that I changed it with and they just go so much better than the laces that it came with. This is the laces that it came with. These laces are hideous. I am not putting this on my shoe. There's no black on this shoe at all. What was the point of this? No offense to anyone who likes it. I just don't think this goes at all. It's not my jam. Um, yeah. Okay, so this is like the interesting part. So then you have the tongue, which is like that cream color like I had said, and then the Nike symbol is also like a white. And then getting into the inside of the shoe. This is a leather. So it's not like your normal dunks where it's just like that, you know, normal material that goes in the inside. Like this is like a leather inside, like a buttery leather. And then you have the Nike with a swoosh in pink. And then inside the tongue, it's also that baby pink color. And then the tongue is very like plush. So that's what I said. It's not to the extent of an SB, but it's definitely not a dunk glow, like a regular dunk glow. Very padded, I would say that. So getting to the back side where the heel is and the inside again is like that baby pink and then it's very padded, like very comfortable. It reminds me of my vintage green dunk glows. These are definitely going to be my new favorite dunks. I just love the color. It's like my favorite color. I feel like this is the shoe for spring and summer for girls. I always like to go over what these are right now in the market and how much you would be spending because again, they are sold out on sneakers. I use Go as I always say. So on Go for my size, which is a size six, it's going for 164. So that's like a little bit over retail, um, but not too much. If you're a size six and a half in women's, it's 163. Size seven is 171. Size seven and a half is 175. Size eight is 168. If you're like a size five in women's, it's 169. Five and a half, 170. So these are going a little bit over 
retail. I just don't know if I like this inside of the leather. Like, it feels like uncomfortable. I don't, I don't know. Why did they do that? Why? What was the, who thought this was a good idea to put leather in the inside? Um, I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm gonna go do a try on now, so make sure you watch these on my feet. Try them on. Stay tuned for the washed pink Air Jordan 1 highs. Um, getting those soon in the mail. Thank you.